everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my April favourites. I have never filmed a favourites video before so I'm very excited and I'm also very proud of myself for actually keeping up with my schedule. I currently upload videos every Sunday night and Tuesday night. So it usually goes up around 8pm German time. Also, if you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up. And if you like my content, please subscribe to my channel. It really does help me and it supports me. And I would be so grateful if you could do that. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. I'm going to start off with anything that is beauty or makeup and skincare, anything like that. So the first product I want to talk about is one of which I wasn't sure if I actually wanted to include it in this video just because I don't know where it is available. I think it is a German brand, at least it has a German name. So I don't know if this will be available to you too, but I have loved this product for years and years and not just this one in particular, but also other products from that brand. And I'm gonna show it to you. It's, I have to be careful because my fingers get really oily. It's this product. It's called Freiöl. So basically it is a shaping oil, shapes and firms the silhouette. And this one is actually really good. I'm gonna have to put it down because my fingers get really oily. I don't know if I should believe in what they are saying, it, that it, the product is supposed to do. But it definitely feels really, really good on the skin. It hydrates my skin so much and I've loved this for years and years. I have used their original oil as well. And then when this one came out, I just thought I'd give it a go. And it has worked out really well for me. And it is included in this video because, as I've said, I have loved it for years. And then all of a sudden, I just kind of stopped using it. And I don't even know why I did that. So it retails for around... 16 or 17 euros depending on where you buy it obviously so it is quite expensive for just a body oil that i use every single day so i put this on like sometimes even twice a day and this is actually the only like beauty body product we are moving on to facial products the first one i want to talk about is this one it's the ren clean skincare ever calm ultra comforting rescue mask and this is honestly so good. I don't feel like there's a lot of product in here and it's almost empty, but it's honestly, it's really, really good. It's like foam that you put on your face. You leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes. I mostly do 15 minutes just because I love it so much. And honestly, this is so nice. It does exactly what it says. It really, really calms down your skin. Next one. Okay, this is another product. Well, I don't know where this is available, but it definitely is available where I live. So basically these are clear up stripes and they are supposed to get out any kind of black hats you have. So you usually get them around your nose, your forehead and then on your chin as well. I've tried many, many clear up stripes. I've tried clear out masks. I just kind of had to put them on my nose and on my forehead and then on my chin and it would dry down while it was on my face and then you were supposed to just pull it off but that never worked out so I always kept pulling and it just never worked didn't get them off in one piece I would not recommend buying that these have actually been really really good I will continue to buy these just because they are the best clear up stripes I have ever tried next product Last bit of skincare. It is the Mario Badescu facial spray with aloe, herbs and rose water. And this is just a very, very nice product that you can just spray on your face whenever you feel like it. Kind of just moisturize your skin. It smells really good. If you don't wear makeup and you just wanna hydrate your skin in the middle of the day, this one is perfect to carry around in your bag as well. The next product I wanna talk about is actually something I'm wearing today. It is on my lips. It is the Becca, let me just check that. Ultimate Lipstick, yours truly. And I believe this was a limited edition. I'm not entirely sure. I just love a nude colored lipstick. And I've had this for a while, but this month I have been wearing it to death. I have been literally putting this on every time I filmed a video. So 
this one is definitely one of my favorites so next part of the video I want to talk about some random favorites of this month that I've had and because I'm in isolation it is mostly TV music that kind of stuff first I want to start off with a TV series that I have started to watch or continue to watch more likely I started to watch this in January stopped like in season three and just because I thought it wasn't that good and then I was bored whilst in isolation and I went back to it so this series is actually available on Sky I saw this somewhere else as well I think it's also available on Amazon Prime but it's once upon a time it's like it's like such a random favorite because this series has been around for so long yeah it's just like a really random favorite of mine that I've watched and then also like listen okay I have always been a huge Harry Potter fan and at the moment Sky has a Harry Potter channel so I, they constantly play the movies and I've been watching that a lot as well so I just wanted to include it in my favorites because it has been something that has kept me up, keep occupied while I was in isolation or while I am in isolation so I absolutely love that and then I want to talk about music this month I have listened to a lot of George Michael music and I have really listened to a lot of Dua Lipa music as well so um, these are just sort of two favorites that I wanted to include if you want to check that out yeah and otherwise I feel like I feel like it's very very hard to talk about favorites and these kind of things at such a weird time because let's be honest all I do the entire day is stay at home in my sweatpants and watch TV, read or do something else. Like it's not like I can go outside and actually do something and discover new things and be like, oh, I really like this and this is like something that I could include as a favorite of mine. So this is the end of this video. Comment down below what your favorites are and leave me any kind of video suggestions you have. I would really love to know what you would like to see and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!